doing a Christmas haul. I'm so excited. So in today's video, I'm just gonna share with you guys what I bought. So I just got some stuff from Walmart. I hit the jackpot at Walmart. Um, so I highly recommend going there. I'm so glad that I went now when it's still really early because they had a lot of stuff. I'm sure it's going to sell very quickly. So excuse my appearance. I just ran a 5k with my girlfriends and then went shopping and I just look kind of like a mess, but I didn't feel like putting on makeup or anything like that. So you guys know me, I typically don't do that. <laughs> um, okay, so we're gonna start with my front porch. So I already have a wreath and it just has like um, acorns and like is sprayed with snow and it looks wintry. So I'm just gonna put that one out because the one I have right now looks kind of like spring or summer. Um, so I got these lanterns. I'm so excited. They were only $15.98. And they're so pretty. I love them. And then they have like this little uh, buffalo check print. So I'm very excited. I got two of them. So I'm going to put them on both sides of the door. They're like exactly the same. I did find these other ones, but I liked the white because the other ones were red and I feel like with white it's better because then after Christmas I can keep them out. I can put them out now before we're, like, we're in November so before Christmas and it doesn't look too Christmassy um, but it still goes with Christmas um, because I like to keep things very minimal after Christmas. I take down all Christmas decor, but it, it, it is nice to find something that you can leave out that relates to winter. Um, I just feel like you get more for your money because you can use it longer. So that is gonna be for winter. Now I have two, you guys will see what I'm talking about. I'm gonna show you. I have two uh, trees. They're like, I don't really know what they're called, but there's two trees on both sides of my door, on the front door. Um, so I'm going to put these bows, not now, but once I decorate for Christmas, the, both of these bows on both sides of the door, um, on those trees so that I think that'll look really pretty. And then, um, I did get, <laughs> I did get these, these were really inexpensive, $3 and 98 cents. And it has like this wood with um, some sticks, like it's obviously fake. And I'm gonna put that in this black um, Joanna Gaines like Magnolia bin that I have. Um, so I got two of them. I'm really excited about that. I think that'll look pretty. I don't wanna put it, on, I wanna put it on the front porch, but I'm afraid that the bin will rust. So I'm not gonna probably put it on the front porch, but we'll see. Um, and then I got one tree topper because I didn't have a tree topper and I thought this was really pretty and it was only $8.98 for our Christmas tree. There's my dog's face. Um, and then these LED cool white lights were only $5 and there's a hundred of them. Um, so I got this for our uh, Christmas tree for our room and I got three of those. And then these little trees match the ornaments that I have for our downstairs uh, Christmas tree. So I am going, to, I got two of them, they were only $4. And I'm gonna put them on the, um, the table that we have coming inside of our house. And then I have on the back of our front door, on the inside of our house, I have a little hook and I always have something hanging on there, whether it's um, like flowers or whatever it is. So I'm going to actually put, it says Merry Christmas. So I'm going to put that on the inside of our house. So I'm excited about that. I thought that was really pretty. Um, and then on the, um, on the outside, I already told you guys I have, um, well, when it's Christmas time, I do have a, uh, plaque like this that says Merry Christmas y'all. It's really cute um, and it kind of looks similar to this but a lot bigger. Um, 
so I'm gonna put that once it's Christmas time but right now the wreath it's just gonna be um, like a winter one okay and then a couple other things so these were only $2 these were only $2 Sadie watch out <laughs> these were only $2 and I am going to put these on our table in our master bedroom um, just to add like a little touch of Christmas but I thought these were so cute they had so many of these $4 $2 $1 they were like mini um, so very inexpensive and then I want to decorate decorate our downstairs bathroom just simple um with i want to use so these are only 98 cents and i have a bunch of mason jars so i'm gonna put this in a mason jar um it these are so pretty they had tons of different ones um so it just looks like really festive so i figured i could just put that in a mason jar and it would kind of like on the back of the toilet in a mason jar and it would just kind of look Christmassy and pretty. So I'm gonna wait to do that until um, after my baby shower um, so that it doesn't look too Christmassy <laughs> before the baby shower since our theme is our little pumpkin and hence why I have a pumpkin right here on my couch. Um, okay, and then the very last thing, oh, actually I have a couple other things I'll show you. Um, so I got this pillow for $5. Walmart has like the best prices and I just thought it was so cute. It says farm fresh Christmas trees, cut and carry, pine, spruce, um, like it just, I just thought it was so cute and it's green on the back. So I'll probably replace this one and put this one in again, $5. So it's just like a, a de decor piece. Um, it's, it's actually, I think an outdoor yeah, it's considered an outdoor pillow, but I always get these from Walmart because they're $5 and they always have really cute prints on them. They had some that say Merry Christmas, which I already have from a couple years ago. So I'm going to put that one on the other side of the couch and then I want to put this one right here. So very, very cute. Um, so two other things I'm going to show you is our Christmas tree for our master bedroom it was only $30 and it's a flocked six foot tree, six or seven foot tree. Um, so I thought that was awesome. I already have the one for our family room. I'm so excited to put that one up. I cannot wait. Um, and then I also got a little, I'll show you like a little um, something to go on the front porch. So here's the Christmas tree that we got. It was only $30. I could not believe it. And it's a six foot flocked tree. And then I just got those $5 um, set of 100 lights. I got three of them, so 300 lights. So this is what the tree looks like. I can't even believe it. It's so pretty and it's only 30 bucks. And then this was, um, I think this was 34, 34, almost $35 for this. And I thought this was just so pretty. So I'm thinking before Christmas, I am going to put, I'm gonna turn it around because it just looks like that and keep it on the front porch. And then once Christmas comes, like after Thanksgiving, I'll turn it around and put Merry Christmas out. So, love it.
Turns look on the front porch. I think it really ties in with the white trim around the door and then my green trees right there that have the black bottom um, pot holders. I feel like everything just really is so cohesive and looks nice and I do end up putting the red ribbons on the front. Um, I'll be sure to add that clip in here. Um, I see the thing was when I was recording this I it, it was before my baby shower but now it's after my baby shower so I have added all of the Christmas decor in now today is November 19th when I'm editing this so I have added all of my Christmas decor all throughout my house so this video is over a course of a few days that's why I, I kept saying oh I'm not gonna decorate for Christmas yet but I have officially decorated for Christmas and I'm so happy with how everything has turned out and be sure to check out Walmart because seriously these were amazing deals I couldn't even believe it so here is what the front porch looks like after adding the lanterns and my new uh, and the wreath and then I want to get a new mat just for Christmas, doormat that says like Merry Christmas on it. Um, but I'm so happy how this has turned out. And now we are going into the entryway and just in that little basket, I decided not to put it on the front porch. And I am just putting those um, little like sticks and fake wood in that basket just to add a touch of like the warm winter warm vibes during a cold winter season <laughs> so i'm just adding that into the basket and then we're going to head upstairs into my master bedroom and this is going to be on a different day and do the christmas tree in our master bedroom and then lastly we are doing the beautiful beautiful christmas tree in our family room i'm so incredibly in love with it i am so happy and i can't wait to share it with you guys I like to clean it down so in this case I just wanted to get any like dust or dog hair or my hair off of the floor before putting up the Christmas tree and yes I know it's going to get dirty because this is a flocked tree so yes I was covered in white fake snow and the floor was also covered in white fake snow but I was just happy to get everything cleaned up prior to decorating and that's what I typically always do anytime I decorate. And also I did have, of course, Christmas movies going on in the background. I pretty much watch Christmas, like once November, mid-November hits, which we're on the 19th now, I literally watch a Christmas movie from um, Netflix or Amazon Prime every single day. And when I was decorating our master no, not our master, our, well, I did watch a Christmas movie while I was decorating this tree, but then when I was decorating the family room tree, it took me like two and a half hours to do that tree, and I watched two full movies, and it was awesome, and then I put on a third one and just relaxed and looked at the tree, so I will say, I will admit, I'm a Hallmark 
Christmas junkie. I love watching them. They always have a really nice happy ending and I feel like it just always puts me in the Christmas spirit and it just I don't know what it is about it I just love all of the endings are so happy and it just reminds me of Christmas so I have to watch a Christmas Hallmark movie um, I love the princess switch uh, with Vanessa Hutchinson um, on Netflix I watched all three of those um, the royal royal princess one where she marries the prince then the second one she has the wedding and then the third one she has a baby um, I love I just love all of them so if you like to watch the Christmas movies as well comment them down below I also love the classics um, like the uh, what is it the Christmas um, Christmas Vacation that is my all-time favorite one. I love Christmas Vacation. So I love all the classics too, but I also love the ones that are Hallmark. Um, I just, I love Christmas in general. So I'm curious, when do you guys start decorating for Christmas? Do you do it before Thanksgiving? Do you do it after Thanksgiving? Um, I personally like to do it mid-November before Thanksgiving because once January 1st, Actually, the day after Christmas, when it's literally the day after Christmas, I take everything down. Um, so I try to put it up mid-November so that I have all of December pretty much and then half of November to admire it. And then after Christmas, I take it all down and I just decorate for winter. Um, I don't like to have any Christmas decor up after December 25th so um, that's why I like to have mine up pretty early but I'm curious what do you guys typically do don't get a king of christmas tree you should definitely get yourself some gloves because this actually really helps i remember in the past my hands always hurt from because we always have fake trees but anyways i am so in love with how pretty this flocked tree is i got it from king of christmas and i'm going to my goal is to fluff all of this and then I am going to put the next piece on, fluff that, then the top and fluff that. So it comes in three different pieces. And then all of this here is all of my decor to go on top. So I am so excited. <laughs>
how the tree turned out. So it's a seven foot tall flocked Christmas tree. I am so in love with it. It is absolutely beautiful. I feel like the camera doesn't even do it justice. So again, I got this from King of Christmas. I bought it last year after Christmas. And this is our first time having a tree in this house, in our brand new house. So I am so excited. So next is going to be decorating. So I have, this is gonna go underneath the Christmas tree. I just got it on Amazon. I'll link it down below. And then I got pretty much all of this on Amazon and at Walmart. So here's the star that's gonna go at the top of our tree. And I went with like a champagne color for the ornaments. So these are all of our ornaments. I got two boxes. So I'm hoping that's going to be enough. This is just a little a little tree I need to find somewhere to put it. And um, and then I'm going to put these, I don't really know what to call them, but I just thought it would be cute and like spruce up the tree. And then I got uh, like 300 or I got 200 lights of this. And then I got another 200 LED string light. So I'm gonna use these first to see how much it takes up and if I need um, then to use the more over there. So, and then I'm just watching a Christmas movie on our TV, Dear Christmas. So, oh my gosh, I'm so in love with it. I can't wait. So next we are going to start putting on the lights. The snow is falling down. I've been longing for this Christmas When everyone's around To share this holiday Yes, it's a time of happiness A time of joy But now this year is twice as special Cause I'm hoping for us to fall in love In this winter wonderland Chilling by the fire As I'm trying on the tree i love the way that this turned out the champagne colors just looks so beautiful i can't wait to show you all when it's dark out so we can get like a good view of what the christmas tree really looks like so here's like i have sparkly ornaments these have some other types of designs on them super 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 cute i absolutely love it again i just got them off of amazon Last year I thought about how things can come around just like that If everyone is here to celebrate one day We have our ups and downs But when there's love there's always a way And oh this time of year we come together to celebrate Yes every time the snow is falling down and it is cold Yes, I am on my way
so happy with how the tree turned out. It is like a dream come true. This is definitely the tree that I was imagining in our family room. And I can't wait to wrap presents for my husband and our baby and put them under the tree and family and friends. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I hope you got some inspiration from it to decorate your own house for Christmas. And if you're new, please subscribe, leave a comment down below and give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.